I mean WAAAAY more. This is a malicious compliance on the part of an employee when I was the customer. I've seen many of these stories from the employee's perspective and thought I'd share mine from the other side. Of course long-time lurker first-time poster. On mobile etc. disclaimers. On a road trip cross-country I stopped to get my kids some lunch at a well-known sandwich place. My youngest about five at the time wants to place his order. So I let him. Cause he's adorable with how he phrases things. He gets to the veggies and specifically states, and can I please get extra pickles? And I don't mean just a little bit extra. I mean WAAAAY more than you think a normal person would ever want extra. The employee smirks and grins and takes both hands into the pickles and pulls out two heaping handfuls of pickles to pile onto his six in sandwich. His eyes light up and with the biggest smile exclaims, now that is extra pickles. Quote, the fallout? A super excited five-year-old that finally got how many pickles he wanted on his sandwich and made the employee's day by thanking them profusely for the best sandwich he ever had. He ate every single pickle. Edit, since it was mentioned more than once. Considering all the stories on this sub of workers doing exactly what the employee did in this story enjoying giving the customer exactly what they said they wanted despite it seeming unreasonable, I thought it fit. Also, y'all have made our day with the love. And the kid also learned how to ask for what he wants. Many of us have yet to figure that one out. Delicious Compliance R. Delicious Compliance This needs to go in R. Wholesome Compliance too. There is compliance. But that kid is wholesome to the max. Dash. Why do I suspect your 5-year-old might be happier with a pile of pickles than any sandwich? Your kid is me every time I walk into a subway. I want handfuls. I want every bite to be tangy and crunchy with pickles. I had a similar thing happen while taking my cousins out. The four-year-old asked for exactly two pickles on her sandwich and the employee gave it to her. And she was so happy. Had a somewhat similar situation when I worked a Taco Bell drive through we had to ask how many sauce packets people wanted. One guy said, as much as you are allowed to give me. I pulled out an extra bag and filled it high enough to just barely be able to roll it closed. Thing much have weighed close to 5 pounds. The guy and his friends were stoked though. Even though this happened two decades ago. I have a similar story that I'm still bitter about. I worked in fast food. We had a mayonnaise gun. If someone asked for extra mayo, they got two shots. One day an order came back that read, extra 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 mayo, meaning the person taking. The order specifically pressed the extra button five times. They got six shots. That sandwich ended up sent back and they belittled me like, this is obviously way too much. Why would you send a sandwich like this out? Quote, https www.reddit.com slash r slash kitchen confidential slash comments slash ssnv 0 e slash may this person find their special pickle there is also our adorable compliance have to believe that worker has children and could tell how happy they would make your kiddo by Giving them WAAAAAAY more pickles. Hugs. Thanks for the smiles your post gave me. I have tried something like this twice at probably that same sandwich shop. For tomatoes. But both times I didn't get any more than I'd get if I had just asked for extra tomatoes. The third time I said, I want you to give me as much as you are allowed by law to give me. Quote. I still didn't get as much as I wanted. But it was at least a little more than the normal, extra, amount. 
Apparently you have to be an adorable 5 year old to reach ludicrous speed amounts of veggies. And now I know how to order what I actually want. Thanks small human for the advice. I always ask for an illegal amount of pickles. However many you can give me that'll get you fired. Minus one. Our kid always asked for extra cherries in the Shirley temples he would order at a restaurant. One time there was a handful of maraschino cherries in his drink. Cheers! We have fond memories of that time. When I was a teenager working at a famous restaurant, I finally had the opportunity to make the perfect monster burger with so many pickles. It was thicker than the two pieces of meat. It was amazing. This is adorable. Love it. Is there a sub for adorable malicious compliance? Because this is that. Love it. This post would perfectly fit in our delicious compliance and in our wholesome compliance. I love it. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Aracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.